It's a beautiful day here in Pal World. All my pals are working hard, <laughs> crafting unlimited firearms and fun things. But one cool thing I did recently, oh, wrong button, is that I just leveled up to level 15, which means I can make three bases now. We have this one right here. Plus we've got the unlimited iron mine with my Bowser's going crazy. They should have named him Bowser. I mean, if you're just making things funny enough the way it is, let's just, oh wow, they immediately all went to sleep. That's weird. I mean, if you're just straight ripping off Nintendo anyway, like, why not just name him Bowser? Ooh, a hundred more ingots. That's delicious. Oh, there's a shiny somewhere. Do you hear that? I was teleporting back to get that. I think there's a shiny up on top there. Let's get my flying mount and go up there. This is the wrong flying mount. What is that? Oh, oh, it's another shiny. That's a shiny kitty. Aw, Kativa. I feel bad because they're adorable. Oh, wrong button. Hello, shiny kitty. I'm going to poke you with my pokey stick. I'm sorry. I didn't mean. Ow. No, 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 no. You're not allowed to attack back. Really? I just, let's just, let's just end this soon. I'm so, I'm so sorry. You know what? Here, have one of these. I kind of am excited to see whatever stats this thing has because shinies are always fun. Or luckies, I'm sorry. Oh, he's a lucky pyromaniac, much like myself. And he's adorable. Look how cute they are. So as I was saying, we need to set up another base. There's a lot of areas here. I like these little areas that are nice and flat, but we need to find a really good one because I really want to use those things to make unlimited resources. If we can just put people in like the, the bee guards and the meows, because these meows drop gold coins from farming, we could have a lot of fun doing that. Now I found this area over here that looks absolutely perfect to make a base up. Big, flat, round, a couple gale claws and our socks, whatever those are. I'm not exactly sure what they are, but I want to tame them. Nope. Wow, he got obliterated by floaty fireball boy. It's ridiculous how strong shiny is. He's like, oh, there's a syndicate thug over there. Let's just obliterate him. But we should be able to just build a pal box right here in the center. And if you were wondering where this base is, way on the left side of the map, really good flat zone. I needed to grab some stuff like fiber, some more ammunition. Oh, this is great. My pals even made hyperspheres for me. Woo! Something about making 88 gigaspheres. That sounds like a good idea. Oh, dang, 25 of these? Nah, 88 of these. And someone mentioned that I should try breeding one of these uh, Anubis with a Lunaris. Except uh, those are both females. So I'll just throw her in here and those two should make some sort of weird baby if I give them cake. Yay, cake. Here you go, friends. Enjoy that. So I'm not going to lie. I think this is one of my favorite parts of this game is setting up new bases with new ideas, even if it takes a lot of resources to go back and forth. So let's build down a wooden chest right next to the pal box. Start putting some of our resources within it. Hey, why are you shooting my horse? He was my friend. Here, that's what this guy's for. <laughs> oh, man, that's amazing. That's my job to kill it. Fine. Coming back here, Shiny? You guys like the name Shiny. I think we're gonna keep the name Shiny for him. Nope, you're not going out. Whoa! Dodge that. Shoot that. In the face. And the butt cheek. Ready, get set. Dodge it! Ow. I tickled. Don't do that again. And captured. And let me at it. No, oh, I wanted to climb it. And got it. Very good. This area looks getting dangerous. There's a lot of thugs hanging around here. Thankfully, the, the thugs aren't too dangerous. I don't know. Maybe this wasn't a great place to put a base, but I'm going to capture a Gale Claw, so I have that going for me. Ow. Please take the green sphere. Oh, yeah. Another Gale Claw. That's one of the other things I want to do with this base because we can dig up spheres as well. So pals, let's get our ranch going. I need more wood. But oh, you two made a baby. Where are you going? You're not done. Get back in the breeding box. Give me the egg. I want to see what this does. A large rocky egg. Oh, that reminds me. I got a large dragon egg too. All right, set that egg. There's that large rocky egg. I have no idea what this could be, but I just follow the comments section. A dig, dig toys. I have those, but that one's actually pretty good. He's serious and abnormal. 
Also check this out, a huge dragon egg. I have no idea what this could be, but I'm excited about it. Come on, friend, it's gonna be a uh, relaxosaurus. Great, I only have 10 of those now. Man, it could have been something cool. Not gonna lie, they are pretty cool. What's this one? A flame bell. And then we have a large other one. This is probably gonna be a, a jolt hog. And it's a, a ray hound. Hold up. That's something new I haven't seen before. Oh, he's pretty cool. Can be ridden, can double jump when mounted. Did I get a new mount? Let's see, has he got any cool stats? Not really, he's a hooligan. All right. You go back in the pal box. And I've got to grab some wood to bring it back. Unfortunately, this stuff is really heavy. Also, write a comment down below what I should breed next in the breeding station. All right, it's time to build. I can build four ranches because can I have 16 pets per area? So that's actually kind of exciting. There's a lot. That's not quite flat enough. So let's hit one right in here. I want to make sure all of these are like spaced out properly. Oh, that's going to be real good. There's another Bronx Cherry. That might be one of my favorite pals. I kind of want to capture him. Oh, there's another one over here. My goodness. It's my lucky day. They're worth a lot of experience, too. That's kind of the fun thing. So let's do a little bit of animal abuse and get this guy on our team. If you just abuse it enough, he eventually likes us. How sad is that? Bonk. All right. Capture that in your face. Oh, easy peasy. Hello, friend. Will you be my buddy? Yeah, you will. Oh, wow. Okay, so that would be my fourth one. Awesome. So the Bronx Cherries with, I forget what it was, gave the Anubis. Oh yeah, the uh, Relaxasaur. I wish another Bronx Cherry would show up, but it was only a Mammal Rest this time. This has been five minutes of building these things, so I guess we get to try to capture that now. I've never done that before, so here you go, friend. You, uh, you soften them up a little bit, elbows. This is bad. I've never, nope, 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 you. Uh, attack the mammal. There it is. Burn it. Burn. Oh, wow, that actually does a lot of damage. And he's stuck in the tree. Have some meteor strikes, you dingus. All right, we got some better hyperspheres here. Oh my, this is actually working really well. Shiny's not doing any damage. All right, and take it back. Capture it. Come on, come on, come on, mammal rest time. Mammal rest time. Give me a mammal rest. Give me a mammal rest. Yes, got it. Woo, all right. That's the big one. That's the first time I ever did that. Yes, that was awesome. Shiny did so good. I'm proud of him. Also, we have tons of breeding centers now. Or, uh, that's not breeding center. We're gonna start putting in some stupid things. Like, we don't want these, we want chickens. Cold-blooded hooligan, diet lover, sure. All right, some of these are not very good skills, but I need four of them. You guys are just gonna go make unlimited eggs. We might have to breed a better chicken. Breeding the perfect chicken? That'd be fun. Next up, I want meows. Okay, we have a good meow. But we also have this one, the Meow Crist, which is like kind of the boss, but it's a slacker. So you go do whatever you do, Meow Crist. This one likes working. I think that's what it means. Yep. Artisan gives a 50% work speed, so that's gonna be digging up lots and lots of gold. So the four of them should start making lots of money for me. Yeah, the chickens are already working too. Maybe we need like, something to haul maybe a human because humans only haul which is kind of nice but the Kilimari are really good for hauling too plus a motivational leader is always nice and the vixie i believe are the ones yeah dig up items so we need some vixies in here i only have two of them but they're gonna start getting us lots of cool stuff oh the kremis what does you do too wool we don't need wool Okay, so these guys need a feed box, and I'm hoping that they'll all just eat eggs. That's my entire goal here, that all of the eggs will be brought immediately over here. <laughs> and then we'll be able to capture more univolts because they're invading my base. That's a pretty easy capture. So is that one? Ooh, whoa, don't do that. All right, you're about to get messed up, friend. You're not even my friend, pal. Oh, hello down there. My goodness, this might have been a, not a great place to build a base. There's just a lot of mess happening. Why are you guys out here? It's not meow time. They just obliterated these guys. Go back and make babies and junk. 
or whatever you do. Ooh, I leveled up. That one was a ferocious one. Sick. Stop it. You guys are annoying me. Good. It looks like yeah, I thought it'd be working. Hey, there is an egg in here, though, so that's perfect. I also really need to get some storage going on. So if I pop in a storage box like here. Look at all that gold already. That's awesome. Why is the meow over here? This might be weird, but I'm going to totally try breeding this mammal rest with a Linaris or maybe an Anubis. Ooh, that one's good. Male, female. Excellent. Can I just pick up the mammal rest? I kind of just want to grab him and pick him up. Who's that good boy? <laughs> Gravity's not a thing on this planet. All right, you guys do the thing where you make an egg and we'll just, yeah, the, we won't ask questions. I'm also trying to find cloth. Thought I had a bunch of it, but evidently I don't. But if I crafted some cloth and I can start making a few beds, we'll just put these generically over here. I wanted to build a barn, but it seems like the pathfinding in this game is a little bit broken, so whatever. I'm really starting to get second thoughts about building here. Every like two minutes, something comes in and attacks. But the good news is the strategy is working pretty good. We're getting a lot, a lot of gold coins already and a few pal spheres being dug up too. I did see some arrows as well. My goodness, I just came up here to find another spot that we could potentially build. That one's got sulfur on it, which is awesome, but there's a lucky over here. So it is my lucky day. I've only had like two other luckies total, but now today we have like two of them already, so that's cool. How do I capture you the best? I probably send in my doggy boy. Yeah. Are you gonna attack, fella? There you go. All right, we're gonna use the big ball on him. I'm scared about this. Your highly effective attacks. Please don't kill him. Oh, all right, all right, capture. All right, 100%, I'll take that. I'll take 100% sweet, sure. Kind of feel bad for these little fellas because I, I stole your friend from you. But you're, I'm, oh, come on. You're my team anyway. Yeah. Right, I missed a tree. All right, we good. We good. We good. Get them both. Get them both. Did I get them both? I got one. Come on. I want that XP bonus. Yes. There's also a chest here. Does this one need a silver key? Nope. All right, fine. You guys can join the party too. Oh, I don't have bullets. Whatever. It's coming on my team anyway. I'll send my, my fox after you. All right, go away. Pokey stick of death. Ow, bro. What do you do that for? I kind of like this spot up here. It's kind of quiet away from anything flying. I don't see any syndicate and I got two dogs and a shiny. This looks like a good spot for me. There was one problem though. It's a hot biome and I'm not a huge fan of that. I could put on, that would actually be just fine. I kind of like this area better though, because it has a sulfur and it is perfect. That blue line is very faint, but you can see it. We don't get up on the cliff very much. We don't get down below. So this is perfect. All right, so I successfully moved the base over here. Found out that these guys, the uh, van worms, are amazing for carrying things. Like, super proud of him. Also, I put up Anubis in here just to help me build things. I do want to create a high quality springs for these guys to lounge in. So I'll pop that down right about here, like such as. And I'm hoping the boy comes over and helps me because this is a three minute build. But now with him, it's like 20 seconds because he's so good at that. Look at that four handiwork. What a stud. There you go, friend. Thank you for the help. I also think I might get another one of those fan worms in here. I don't have any super great ones. I mean, the artisan's good, but nobody's fast. So we'll just do one. It's kind of annoying, too, that they carry one thing at a time. But I mean, whatever, we're farming. This is just massive AFK money farm right here. And I've found that the eggs and the chickens, they make so much that you can never end. I think this is funny too. These woolly pops, they drop cotton candy when assigned to the ranch. I think that's a food source for the creatures. Ooh. Oh, the male packas? Oh, they give wool. But I thought the Mossanda would do something. He's a pretty strong one too. You can get rocket launchers for him. Now I made it back to our home base here. There's a large verdant egg here. I'm scared of it. <laughs> I don't have any idea what's going to be inside of that. Also, Anubis just chilling on the rock up there. Bro, get down. And I did find a frozen egg. I'm guessing this is just going to be something stupid. Like a Swee. Oh, but that's good. Gave me an extra 3750 XP. Let's see what this verdant egg is. No idea what could be in this. But it's a uh, Mossanda. Wow. And a Mindform and Sirius. That's a really, really good one. Why is there a Bronk up top? 
I also really want to build an improved furnace because we're going to need it. Just these regular smelters really aren't enough to delter. There we go. Now the best part is that leveled me up to the next level of pal box. So I can upgrade again and now I get 16 pals. Oh boy, a large pal bed. That's actually not too bad. And I do have it unlocked, so that's awesome. Also, the single shot rifle is ready, but it needs polymer. Yikes. And the ultra sphere. I'm kind of excited for that, too. Things just really got stupidly expensive. Like real talk. What does a refined ingot even need? Oh, just ore and coal. That's not too bad, except it's like double the amount that reg No, ore is too. Interesting. So it just needs coal. I'm fine with that. Why are you guys pooping out so much milk, too? It's weird. So thankfully, all of the gigaspheres are done. I do want to start crafting up a bunch of these. Oh boy, that's a lot. And collect those pal spheres. Great. Now we got to go get a bunch of the things that we need for the other base. More meows, more vixies, and whatever the last thing was. So I'm on a mission for vixies first. Actually, you know what? We can get some chickpeas too. And I'm wondering if I can't just throw a ball at them. Which one do I have up? Can I just throw a ball and capture them? Oh man, that's pretty close. Nope, don't. Would you not right now? Please, I'm trying to capture these. You can have eggs to eat, dude. Yeah. Hey, there we go. There's some vi- vi- I just totally messed that up. Don't shoot him in the face. That's a good idea. Come back here, Vixie. <laughs> Nothing bad's gonna- Ooh, there's a- Oh, come on. There we go. That's a good shot. And captured it. Now, if I go in here, there should be some mews. You escaped that, you dingus? Ow! You escaped that one, too? Why does this have to be way harder than I thought it was going to be? Stop it! Now I killed you. Or I could just hit him with these. And this should just be an instant capture for pretty much everything. If they get out, I don't really... You got out. I don't really care. I was definitely hoping in these caves I could find some mews, which I did. Or meow. Meow. Whatever they're called. Hey, buddy. Come on in here. Oh, yeah, 65%. That should be good. Where'd your friend go? Come on, little meow. We need to get you. Good. I did not know that mammal rests were territorial creatures. They're just been wailing on each other. This is incredible. I'm going to capture both of them. They're also kind of dumb. Stab it in the butt a few times. Why are you running away, buddy? Why are you run away? They're going into the corner. Is this like one of those things where the, the people just hurt them off a cliff? Yeah, whatever. You're mine now. Ooh, maybe not. 23 only. Wow. You just killed him. Oh, that's annoying. What you, What are you doing here? This is a big boy fight. You're not allowed. Give me that. <laughs> Give me that sphere. I want it. No. I say, hey, give me that. Oh, come on, get the capture. Get the ca ah, I got one more. Catch. Please capture it. Please capture it. Oh, 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 no. This is really dangerous. I didn't know this existed. It's that small settlement. There's a merchant here that straight up buys and sells pals. I don't know. I mean, how much is, is one of these little guys for? I mean, you're a slacker. I'll sell you. 130? Eh. How about something bigger like that memo rest I just grabbed? Oh, 3,000. It's not great. He's downtrodden. I'll sell him any. No, I won't. I'm kidding. I'm not going to sell him. What can I buy, though? What is this? Do I have one of those? I don't know. Do I get experience? Oh, I do. Hot dang. All right. We found the experience farm. So I've been grinding a little bit. Came out of a cave, and there's owls out here. It's nighttime. Hey, hey, give me this. Oh, no. Shoot. I didn't want to kill him. I just wanted to weaken him up so I can throw a ball at his face. And, oh, who grates? Interesting. I've never seen those. Oh, really? Yeah. Buddy. Come on, get captured. I want a new pet. Thank you. Oh, he's a workaholic. That's fantastic. All right, this is hilarious. <laughs> I just came back here after my grinding session. My goodness, look at all this garbage. Pal spheres, coins, arrows, eggs, everything is here. My <laughs> Look at all these coins. Wow. Okay, that's pretty incredible. 3,000, uh, 14, 16, 17, 18, 19. That's hilarious. <laughs> are those the meows or the vixies? I don't remember. Why are you attacking that, bro? I like it too that there's just a good number of eggs here. 
So those are supposed to be walking. Oh, there's a bunch more in here too. So we had like 1600 money plus another 800 <laughs> for like 20 minutes. <laughs> That's incredible. I love it. The best part is I don't even need that Anubis here. And I did just capture a whole bunch of other things. I don't think I need any more chickens, but I captured a bunch of them. But these meows could be good. Also, what does this guy do? Orcaholic Dark Knowledge is just kind of a dumb. That's what he is. <laughs> but I put more meows in there so we can make even more money. Look, they're just going to go dig. It was a good little diggy. They're just grazing. Wow, that's so cool. So many grazers. I did get some more Vixies too, but I don't know if I need all of the tier one balls. Uh-huh. Burly body and aggressive, ferocious. Those are good for like a capacitor. What does that mean? Oh, lightning attack damage. You don't even have that. Yeah, so I didn't get any good Vixies, but I did get a good ones of these. And look at them digging. Oh, you're digging for something. Yay. Did you find treasure for me? I'm going to go see. Oh, you did. An arrow. I don't know why there was an arrow dug there, but that's cool. There's another arrow. This is how to make big, big stacks of cash. Then you can buy pals with it. Like, who who doesn't like that? Anyway, my friends, that'll do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. I love this game. So keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brett, Dalton C, Scatter D, Mr. Cripple One, Baton Please, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Link Hewitt, Tyler J, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Wyatt H, Honor Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Rittler Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Baxter, Ral, VC Engineer, Scars Marex, Spencer T, Whiskey, and YH.